Hello there. This is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another video. Expand your mind for power. Expand your mind for power. Let me make sure y'all can see everything behind me. Yeah. And now, you know, on these Saturday videos, I'm always in front of my bookcase. And anyone who knows me know, yeah, I'm always talking about body game, always talking about hitting the gym and everything. But I'm also a strong proponent of having a library card. I'm also the type who a hot date for me is hanging out in a big bookstore and just walking around. <laughs> You know, I remember a young lady, um, and she might even watch this video. We were, uh, we went out back in 2019. It was uh, like a day thing. And one of the things we did after having, um, you know, a nice uh, lunch and everything, we went to this bookstore and we were just sitting in there chilling. Because one of the things, one of the things, and you know, I've been talking about not just having, um, you know, a strong body, but a strong mind. But just the thing is that when you have the knowledge, when you are able to think, uh, that's, a, that's a source of power. Indeed, uh, my next channel, and actually the channel a lot of people say is their favorite, is my deep thought channel. And the pure thing on there is just thinking. Even when somebody might disagree with something that I'm saying, I'm not putting anything out to take a stand on it. I put out stuff just to think on. And all I say is just articulate a good thought. <laughs> just that's all you have to do on there because it means that you're thinking. Now, one of the things I'm seeing with a lot of men, especially, is they're not expanding their minds. Once they get to a certain place, that's it. Even if they make it money with where they're at, that's it. You need to constantly expand your mind because the thing is, knowledge is power, but uh, it's a, it's a applied knowledge is power. When you have knowledge of something, even if it's small, like let me give you an example. How much money, if you have knowledge on just how to change your oil, how to, how to rotate your tires yourself, or how to fix many things in your car, that's power. Because think about it, how much money do you save? other than buying the oil and maybe a few tools, instead of sitting in some car dealership uh, or a car place and you paying mainly for their labor, not even for the tools. There's plenty of things I've fixed in a car myself and I'm not even a car person, but just having that little bit of knowledge or having knowledge on how to do these videos. How many, how many men have just made money just knowing how to do the videos? And when I talk about knowledge, it's not just the book knowledge, that's important, but just knowledge period, street smarts, that's knowledge. That is knowledge. Now, in order to have all this, you have to be willing to expand your mind. You need to be willing to exercise your mind. Just like I say, go in the gym and you know, you're gonna do, you're gonna do the bench press and you know, the squats or leg exercises, you're gonna do the curls. You have to exercise your mind as well. You have to expand your mind. You have to make the muscle in your mind bigger. But the only way you're going to do that is you have to exercise. You know, like I said, like whenever there's any issue, any major issue or something, I'll look at both sides of it. Even in my book, Nice Guys and Players, I said, read uh, material or try to get an idea about the material of somebody whose thought processes go against yours. And, you know, you got to put your emotion to the side. You might not like them or you might not like the idea. You could still be diametrically opposed, but know about it. You know, the uh, legendary treatise, Art of War, Sun Tzu said, if you know your enemy and you know yourself, you need not fear the results of a hundred battles. But it's the same thing. If you know yourself and you know the situation or you have an idea about it, boom. Because knowledge is everything. Knowledge of people, knowledge of social interactions. You know, one of the reasons that many men uh, tune into this channel is because of the knowledge I have of women. How did I get that knowledge? Not really from reading. People say, well, where'd you read that? No, you can gain knowledge just by your experiences. Like every single experience, every single experience you have, that's knowledge. You know how to handle it. You know, if we're talking about women, okay, you get this woman who cheated on you or something. Okay, you know, start know what they're looking for. Like I always tell the story when, um, no, it was, a, it was a, a, a friend of mine, just platonic because she was married. But I remember when we met, 
we met at this expo. And I said to her, I said, uh, you know, we just said blase, blase, quick high. But then it, as I was leaving, I said, hey, be careful. You open and cheat on your husband. And then we took another hour talking. She explained to me why she would cheat on her husband. Now someone will say, how'd you know that? Experience, knowledge. I know what signs to look for. I know what signs to look for and stuff. You know, as far as making money, like doing sales. Like my main thing, I'm a salesman. I'm a salesman. Getting people to tune into my videos, that's sales. When I'm out in, uh, like at a vending show or something, selling some books, that's sales. When I've worked for other people, like uh, in retail sales and also uh, gym sales, it was knowledge. It was like, oh, okay, if I have this posture or I engage the person this way, boom, no matter what. And especially in, yeah, let's, let's talk about just your vocation in life. All men gotta work. Whether you're on a job or business, the more knowledge that you have, the better. If you're on a random job, like I'll use a retail example. When I was working retail, I would just ask the, you know, because my main thing was actually just merchandising. But I would ask the general manager, I would just ask him random questions. I would just ask him random questions about the other stuff that they had to look at. Because I said, hey, I might want to start a retail business one day. And that's another thing. Just. Just in life, like the more knowledge you have in different areas, the more you can navigate stuff. If you have knowledge of, uh, like, uh, if you have knowledge from everything from uh, painting, how to paint properly, to how to cut grass, to how to fix a car, to how to drive a tractor trailer, to how to uh, fix a laptop, how to fix a phone, that gives you more power because then you can always make money. You can always switch up. Like somebody say, well, Ron, how'd you work in a government but then work retail? I've had a thousand jobs. Now, one of the things with me is there were times I, when I was working in the government, I was working in the gym too. So that was two things, two things I'm qualified for. So that was the thing. But it all comes down to knowledge. And every men should always be reading, like reading and experiencing. Like you learn from experience, but also reading. Because here's the thing, even when you're reading something, it's like you're having a conversation with the author. Because no matter how objective we try to make it, it's still our personal thoughts. It's how we interpret it in whatever. All right, you still learning something. You still getting the knowledge. When I'm on, uh, sometimes when I'm on YouTube, I don't check out a lot of channels, but sometimes some news program or some documentary will come up and I'll sit there like, mm -hmm, because I'm learning something. I'm expanding my mind, I'm exercising it. And then one thing, and this is something that's especially I do on my Deep Thought channel. Sometimes I'll just think about something random. Seriously, I'll just think about something random, especially if it's something I'm not familiar with. I'll think, well, what is it? What if I did this? What if I did that? What's up with that? You're actually thinking. See, unfortunately, many people, not just men, but people, period, will just go through life not really thinking about what they're doing, not really thinking about it. They're uh, robots, almost like zombies. They're half asleep. You want to go through, you want to expand your mind, you want to pay attention to stuff. You want to just look at stuff. You want to learn from it. Like, I remember somebody say, somebody, uh, it was a woman pointed this out about me and stuff. And I just laughed because I said, hey, you're reading me well. She said, you know, Ron, sometimes you just sit back, just be looking around. Just be looking around. Not like, uh, but I just be looking at stuff. Got a serious look, be thinking about it, pondering it, recording it. That's knowledge. That's knowledge. So you want, and it's all about power. It's all about power. Like, if for whatever reason this YouTube thing don't work out, I know I have multiple options for jobs. It's working out, but I'm saying if I get tired of it, I can say, hey, I can, I can you know, work for a government agency doing certain things. I could do retail. I could start my own store, but that's knowledge. And then just having just general knowledge anyway, sometimes I'll like learn something, read about something, see something, and I'll put it away. I'm like, oh, okay, let me just follow it away. I don't need it for now. There have been numerous occasions when not my knowledge of something that had been filed away for a while comes to use. 
I was like, oh, wait a minute. I know about that. Do -do 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 -do. In fact, I had a girlfriend. She actually said, they say, mom, you got that computer. I can see it. It's like, do -do 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 -do. oh, do -do 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 -do. <laughs> but you do it for power. Men need power. Men need power. Knowledge applied is power. You know, you want to, um, I ain't going to use the term mind game. I'll come up with a term for that. I'm used to saying body game. Mind game sounds manipulative and stuff. I'll just say building your mind for, for now, expanding your mind. So this is what you need to do. All men, all men need to do that. That's our thing. That's, that's our, really our game. And really, there's a deeper level to that, too. There's a deeper level to that, just that knowledge, that power there. But I'll save that for another occasion. So anyway, that's all I have for now, y'all. You know, even working, even working the camera and everything, I had to get knowledge on how to do this right. You know, you know, working it with my smartphone. I had to get knowledge. It made everything so easy. Cause when I first started, even with this particular camera, I had to go up, do, do, all that stuff. Then I had to like cut all the moving around. Then I was like, oh, I can operate it with my smartphone. Oh, dang. Do, 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 do. You know, I mean, I could have fun with this. Look at it, just a little bit of knowledge on it. Well, they ain't gonna get me right. <laughs> but knowledge, even every little bit, every little bit helps. Every little bit, it helps things to be better. Yeah, cause I was about to cut off my head and stuff. Let's give, give y'all a close up, but then I had to raise it up, but just even knowledge of that. So anyway though, that's all I have for today, y'all. Hey. Build that knowledge, build your mind, expand your mind. It's all about power. Talk to y'all later. Peace and blessings.